Shalom, family! God bless you all. Thank y'all for tuning in for today's property tour. And today, my friends, we are at Bum -ba -dum, 1680 Jan Marie here in Lucas, Texas. Going to be checking out this absolutely stunning, marvelous, custom dream home. Alrighty, my friends. Now, this is going to be a seven bedroom, six and a half bathroom, five car garage, 8,729 square feet, sitting on just over two acres of land. Alrighty, my friends. So, hopefully, you guys enjoy. Be sure to hit that thummy thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already joined the YouTube Familia. And if you're looking to move to the Dallas Fort Worth area, my friends, you guys can always visit us on our website or Instagram and fill out an inquiry form. Alrighty. Outside of that, my friends, be sure to stay tuned for the good news towards the end of the video. By far the greatest part of the videos is the good news, my friends. Alrighty, don't you miss that good news. All right, man, oh man, I am super excited to take y'all along this just stunning home, my friends. Absolutely beautiful. Uh, I wanna give a huge thank you to Joanna Slaughter with Fathom Realty for letting us take a tour of her gorgeous listing. Alrighty. So right hand side, as y'all can see, you have the nice, beautiful matte black bookshelves, study area, and you also do have a, a little hidden room there. So um, would love to know in the comments below what y'all would use that hidden room for. I think that's a nice feature. You also do have a, a gorgeous wood burning fireplace with the marble mantle all throughout, absolutely stunning. And right beside you, you do have a nice little courtyard with another fireplace. So there's plenty of fireplaces here, guys. I can't tell you how cozy it is right now, <laughs> all right? For some odd reason, the weather just dropped to like 45 degrees here in Dallas and um, randomly last night. But in here, guys, I feel toasty. I feel like a toasted marshmallow right now. <laughs> I don't know why I said that, but all right, look at this. I mean, the archways leading up to this beautiful open floor plan. I mean, sliders all throughout the back. Got these beautiful wooden custom beams. I mean, the architecture, the design, the color schemes, it just it just screams modern. Um aesthetically pleasing farmhouse style. I mean, I am absolutely just amazed at the way they really just decorated it and they put this beautiful home together. So you do have that nice uh, dark tile mantle with the wood burning fireplace. You have these really gorgeous light fixtures, very sleek and modern. And we're gonna tackle on this area here in a bit, but before we do that, let's tackle on the other bedrooms downstairs. And so here you do have a full half bathroom. All right, you got the really nice gold accents with the dark schemes, which is a very popular color choice that um, is very, very in, in style right now. You know, the dark gold, and um, that is a very, really popular style right now. And you also do have these little desk areas here for the kiddos, so when they come back from school, boom there's no excuse they're gonna do their homework <laughs> no excuse all right and uh here you do have the um let's just call it you know little kimmy's room here all right kim's room all right got a nice window overlook in the front yard there and she has her own little bathroom tucked away single vanity quartz countertops and nice little walk-in closet i mean absolutely stunning and you have a full bathroom here with a very unique um backsplash there tile backsplash Alrighty. now this is a, a custom home my friends um and so typically when a custom home is being built from scratch the beautiful thing about the process itself is that you get to make it the way you want it, right? You sit down with the architects, you get to design and and and, and really uh, put your design and your your imagination to the home. And so this is what these um, 
wonderful homeowners did when they built this custom home. So they sat down with a, a prominent, very well-known uh, custom builder. And so they were able to really draw out and see their vision come to life. And so um, that alone, the custom build route, my friends, that can take you know anywhere from 16 to 18 months. So you can only imagine the amount of sweat, um, uh, tears, and, and just hard work that was put into this beautiful um, custom home, guys, all right? There's a lot of pieces that come together from the foundation, from the framing, the electrical, the plumbing, the architecture, design, permitting. I mean, there's a lot of things, guys, that come together when it comes to building these custom homes. And so it is truly God-given talent. Um, it just, to see what, I mean, some of these amazing homes has to offer. I mean, it's just, it just, once again, just shows the beauty and the um, creativeness that uh, the Lord has really gifted, you know, his, his children. And so anyways, uh, but as you can see here, you have the three bedrooms, nice light fixture there. And then we do have the uh, utility room, which we're going to hold off here in a bit because it does connect to the primary, which we'll get to that here in a bit. Um, but I really love these archways as you're leading up to this gorgeous open floor plan. So let's tackle on the right side of the home first before we move on over to the left side. But as you can see here, high, high ceilings. All right. Lots of natural lighting. I know that is a big thing for a lot of my clients is Armando. The first thing they say, well, here's how it really goes, guys. All right. <laughs> The husbands will get on the phone and then, you know, typically the wives are in the background, you know, they're listening. They don't really say anything up until the husbands, up until I ask the husband, okay, well, what do you guys want in your home? All of a sudden the wives just pop out of this, the behind the scenes on the phone calls like, okay, I want high ceilings. I want a big kitchen. I'm like, where were you at in the beginning? <laughs> no, nah, it's all good. My wife does the same thing, y'all. She, I don't know, comment down below if, if you're, you know, be honest. All right. My wives... You know, sometimes y'all be behind the scenes just waiting for the moment. Boom. You know, and so anyways, guys, this home just truly has all those wonderful features to, to offer. I mean, you have the cathedral ceilings here in the primary uh, suite. You have three large bay windows, bring a lot of natural lighting. You also do have access to the outdoor uh, kitchenette patio out there, which we'll get to that in a bit with the gorgeous um, high-end luxury pool. And then check out this bathroom. Whoo, come on now. Chef's kiss. Wowzers. Beautiful quartz countertops. You have warm color tones in here with the gold accents as well. Um, you also do have a seamless glass stand-up shower with a double shower head. So husbands and wives, no fighting. Okay, no fighting. <laughs> All right. And then you got another vanity. You also do have the soaking popular tub that um, is really high in demand really love this um, freestanding tub gorgeous light fixture um, may want to put like a privacy glass window here or maybe some shades to cover that down but and then check out the closet all right here we go y'all ready for this ta-da so when you walk in boom Ooh -wee. come on now Look at this closet. All right, this is the jaw-dropping moment. Husbands, this is where you may want to pause the video, okay? You know, because the wives have now set the bar high. And gentlemen, too, you know. Um, but look at that. Absolutely stunning. Love this entry leading up to the um, bathroom here. Super gorgeous. Um, love the transition from... You know, that nice, uh, I believe that's a porcelain tile or maybe like a marble. And you got the nice hardwood flooring. Oh, that is sick. That is crazy. It just detected that I was coming near it. <laughs> so, wow, look at that. I mean, and then interconnects to the um, washroom here. You do have a slider, uh, sliding door here that does... Um, Close that up. And then for little fur babies here, got their nice little room. All right. I mean, they really thought of everything in this home, guys. You know? Wow. 
And so when you build a custom build, guys, um, typically most custom builders will have maybe lots available that they purchased and, you know, they typically will um, sell those lots that you can build your dream custom home. And so, you know, those lots can range. I mean, I've seen anywhere, especially on this side of town, um, anywhere from 500K to 600, 700K. Um, if you're going to the Rockwall Heath area, there's some uh, lots in the 300s, maybe even 200s. But look at this gourmet kitchen. Got the beautiful, sleek, modern life fixtures. Massive, oversized island. You do have that marble backsplash there for the kitchen. Top of the line, Thermador appliances, which is one of the best when it comes to appliances, guys. Look at this. My lord. This is a mic drop. You do also do have a farmhouse sink, and you got the double um, double entry fridge, Frigidale um, refrigerator there. And then right back here, you have a butler's pantry. All right, little little additional kitchen, so that way, um, you know, in case you don't want to make mess in the main kitchen, this is kind of like where you just throw it down. All right, got a farmhouse sink. You also do have a Thermador a uh, little espresso machine there, <laughs> all right, and microwave, and then walk-in pantry, hey, 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 look at that, gorgeous, I mean, truly stunning, iconic property, so I am definitely getting my steps in, guys, because this is over 8,000 square feet, so in terms of cardio, we getting it done. All right, outdoor little patio here, courtyard, really nice. All righty. And I believe this also does fall into Lovejoy ISD, which is a very highly rated school district. All righty, my friends, um, which is something you really want to consider when you're buying a property, guys. I cannot stress that enough, my friends. Um, location is paramount, you know, especially if you ever decide to resell. You know, you got to make sure if you're going to buy land or you're going to build a custom home or new construction, just make sure you do a lot of preliminary research with the school districts, location, vicinity, what are the uh, developments coming around the area, you know, what's happening around the area. I mean, these things are all important, my friends. So you do have that nice little five-car garage, J-Swing, okay, with the, um, I believe this is the uh, epoxy flooring as well, so... And then upstairs. Whew. Man, oh man. All right. Upstairs, another fireplace. So I'm telling you, this is why this home feels so cozy and so warm in here. I feel like I said so um, toasty, right? Because there's a lot of fireplaces. And you also do have another bathroom upstairs. So this kind of like little hangout spot, maybe a, a kind of a, a game room. And as you can see, the installation is really, really great um, because you can't hear. As you can see, there's a main um, kind of little um, road there. So you're hearing, you don't even hear the cars passing by, which is amazing. All righty. And now let's tackle on this part of the property now. So here we have kind of a nice little dining or breakfast nook area, um, really beautifully situated. You have lots of windows, the sliders going all throughout, um, which I'm gonna show you guys here a really cool feature because we're gonna open this up. Um, so it is automatic sliders. So it does lead to that backyard, but we'll get to that in a bit, my friends. So. You gotta stay tuned towards the end. Um, by far the greatest part is towards the end. So, um, another little bar area here, popcorn. This is, you know, um, movie central, guys, all right? If you are big movie goers and maybe you wanna save some cost on going to the movies, um, having your own theater in your home is is what I'm talking about. Look at this. Hoo-wee, man, oh man, check this out. I wonder if I could. Oh, you know what? I turned it off. But 
Got the nice projector here, movie room. I mean, got a nice little bar here too. And then for the kiddos, they even have their own little section back there, which is really nice. So, talk about movie room. Yep. All right. And then this right here, guys, I am just really astonished. They created some kind of lower level wine cellar room here. This is super cool. Look at this. Got the spiraling staircase, odd Ryan, leading down to your own little personal cellar area here for your drinks and, you know, in case you have the carne asadas, the barbecues with the family. I mean, look at this. Wines, drinks, everything you can think of right here. Look at that. Talk about just thinking of everything. I mean, wow. And I'm gonna take a wild guess. We also do have a little secret room here. So that's pretty cool. Alrighty. And then you do have a full blown gym inside of your home. All right. Got mirrors here. All righty. And then this is just, yeah. Really cool gym setup. So there's no excuse not to get your workout in, my friends. All right, no excuse. All right. Y'all said y'all this this was the year y'all gonna get in the best shape of your life. <laughs> nah, I'm kidding. But seriously though, guys, got a nice gym. Whew. Man. Alrighty. So I think we just knocked out the whole property in about 17 minutes. I think that's pretty good, guys. Uh, now we got to head over to the backyard because it's about to go down. But look at this beautiful outdoor backyard. You also, oh, there's actually a chair on top, which we're going to get to that here in a bit. Fireplace, really nice outdoor patio. And then look at this pool, absolutely gorgeous. All right, no back neighbors. Nice privacy, lots of mature trees. Very gorgeous. I mean, look at this. Got the nice iron rod fencing all throughout. And you also do have a nice uh, little kitchen here tucked away for the carne, the barbecues, summer nights. I mean, this is like, talk about having the barbecues during summer. This is ideal. I mean, imagine the kiddos playing around here, having a good time, enjoying themselves. Nice separation between you and the neighbors. So it is absolutely stunning. Look at that. Wow. And then here is the cherry on top, my friends. Abuela just got an upgrade. Graham Graham, the mother-in-law, you know, the parents just got an upgrade because they got their own little casita. Man, oh man, look at this. Wow. Look at this, guys. Absolutely stunning. Their own little living room, their own full blown kitchen. They got a full half bathroom here, a bedroom. All right. And then look at this beautiful kitchen as well. I mean, this feels like another house, which it, it actually, I think it just, this is the size of a nice apartment or house. I mean, lots of space, perfect for parents, you know, very ideal. So it could be a pool house or it could be your, you know, mother-in-law suite and really nice and private. So they all have their own privacy. And then here is the primary. All right. So it's a two bedroom. And then you got that nice double vanity soaking tub. Look at that guys. Stand up shower. Wow. This is just really, really, I mean, Yep, guys, they really killed it. Let me know what you guys think about this gorgeous property. Alrighty, my friends. 
because I am just in shock with how great they did. Washer and dryer, and they have their own little garage, which is so cool, guys. Look at that. Their own little single car tandem garage. Alrighty, my friends. Well, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Be sure to hit that thummy thumbs up. And if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, my friends. Alrighty, this is home. Let me know your thoughts, what you thought about it, guys. I would love to hear your feedback. As always, my friends, y'all already know when we get to the backyard, it's time to get real, my friends, because we're about to share with y'all the best news, the cherry on top of these videos. Um, these videos would be pointless without this part right here, my friends, and that is the good news, all right? John 3, 16. For God so loved the world, he sent his only begotten son. And all those that believe in him will not perish, but have everlasting life. My friends, these homes are gorgeous. They're breathtaking. They're absolutely stunning. The builders, architects, designers, everybody involved to making these immaculate properties have such God-given talent, my friends. But I want to share with you a home that is far greater than any home you'll ever see on this side of eternity. And this home that I tell you about is non-perishable it does not come to an end it is from everlasting to everlasting reserved for you and for me and for everybody through the lord jesus christ yeshua the king of kings who paid the ultimate price on that cross at calvary where he shed his precious blood for sinners like us my friends and if we come to him he will forgive us he will redeem us He'll give us a new life and clothe us in his righteousness my friends and this eternal home that i tell you about my friends Hey man, it does not come to an end. You know, here's the reality of it, guys. A lot of the stuff we see here on the side of eternity, guys, it's it's amazing. It's good to enjoy. Don't get me wrong. Alrighty, but they are perishable. Our own bodies, our own everything you see at some point. They will be bulldozing these properties in 200, 300 years from now, or however long it may be, and building brand new spanking new modern i i don't know what they're going to be building in in that amount of time you know who knows maybe <laughs> hopefully the lord will come back by then but um anyways regardless you know hopefully lord willing by god's grace we'll be home with the lord but in our glorified eternal bodies that does not come to an end my friends and so i want to remind you okay that there is something even greater in store all right that the lord jesus christ has to offer and that is life and life more abundantly eternal life okay where you don't have to worry about you know credit checks <laughs> bank statements you know appraisals third-party inspectors because the home that i tell you about guys has been paid in full okay there's nothing that you have to do to try to win or try to earn that house except come to the lord jesus christ through faith repent of your sins trust in him as your lord and savior the king of kings he is our only hope my friends he is our only hope in this world all righty he is the light in the dark he is the everlasting prince of peace living water the bread of life all righty the bible says he who comes to me will never be thirsty will never be hungry all righty jesus offers much more than what this world can offer you eternal hope all righty and he loves you you that is watching this video right now it is not a coincidence that you are here right now here in the gospel all right the bible says he will leave the 99 to find that one and my friend that one might just be you today so it is not a coincidence that you are here listening to the good news of our lord and savior yeshua jesus christ of nazareth the king of kings all righty he wishes none to perish but to come to repentance my friends and the lord wants to offer you a life and a life more abundantly a, a life of peace and joy and happiness in him because the reality of it guys you can amass everything in this life you can do everything you can experience every cuisine every travel every little thing but guys you will still be left wanting more and more and more and more and more and more and more you will never be satisfied because that craving you have inside of you is meant for the lord Alrighty, and he loves you. All right. The Bible says, Brother Paul tells us he has learned to be content with much and with less. Alrighty. He knows because he knows what it's like to have a lot, and he knows what it's like to have barely surviving on a little. Alrighty. But his joy and his peace came from the Lord. 
Alrighty, and that's how that's 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 what I want to share with you guys. Because if you are weary, if you are heavy burdened, if you are heavy laden, if you are going through trials and tribulations and you need a friend to stand by your side and that will never let you down, my friends, that is the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. He will never fail you. Alrighty. Man will fail you, but God will never fail you. He will walk with you through the best of days and through the darkest of days. Alrighty. When things get tough, he's not going to run away. He's going to stand right by you, comforting you. Right? So that being said, man shall not live on bread alone, but by every word that proceeded out of the mouth of God, my friends. We need God in our lives. Alright, he is the foundation. He is the rock. He is the one you need to build your house on because if not, when the winds and the storms come crashing into your house, guess what? It's going to come crumbling down, my friends. If the foundation is not built properly on a house, it will tumble. It will, it will fall down. That's why there's many inspections that have to undergo when you're building a property, guys. A lot of inspections. But this foundation you can trust on. Alrighty. God bless you. Shalom. Peace be with you. All right, just know that Jesus loves you. All right, today can be the day of salvation. I tell you the gospel because Jesus came into my life over two years ago. By God's grace, my wife stood by my side when I transitioned out of the Marine Corps. She prayed for me constantly. She kept not, not ceasing in prayer for my salvation. And by God's grace, after a year straight, she, I, I came to know Yeshua. I came to know the Lord. And I'm sorry, guys, it was almost, I think I want to say it's almost three years now. We're in 2024. Wow, time is flying. But yes, guys, that being said, God bless you. Shalom. I hope you guys enjoyed today's property tour. Alrighty, comment down, hashtag Jesus saves. Tell a friend about Christ. All right, because reality is, my friends, we never know when it might be our last breath. Shalom, peace be with you guys. God bless you. All right, bye-bye, my friends.